the two incidents you just witnessed are occurring with alarming frequency as self-service, prepay, and unattended service stations and convenience stores multiply. In the first situation, where the pump nozzle was equipped with a hold open latch, the customer prior to the lady forgot to disengage the latch. He returned the nozzle to the pump boot with the nozzle still in the on position. When the lady prepaid her purchase, removed the nozzle from the boot and turned on the pump, the open nozzle doused her car and her shoes with gasoline. Her $500 lizard skin shoes were ruined. But the situation could have been worse as it was in the second situation. There we saw a self-service customer using a nozzle without a hold open latch. He jammed open the nozzle handle so the pump would continue filling his vehicle. Unfortunately, he overrode the nozzle's automatic shutoff mechanism with disastrous results. But now there's a solution that's establishing a new standard of safety for the fuel dispensing industry. A solution created here at Husky Corporation, a leading designer and manufacturer of fuel dispensing nozzles and equipment. It's called the Husky Protector 10S nozzle. It meets the new NFPA and UFC fire codes. And it prevents both of the situations you just saw with a double shutoff feature. First, let's look at an ordinary nozzle. When the hold open latch is engaged, the poppet valve stem is pushed upward, allowing gas to flow. Pump pressure forces open the anti-drain valve in the spout. As gas flows, air is sucked in through this port. The fuel flows as long as the vacuum chamber stays in equilibrium with the atmospheric pressure below the diaphragm. But when the car's tank fills, air can no longer enter. The air in the vacuum chamber is sucked out. That forces the diaphragm up which automatically turns off the nozzle. That sounds foolproof, but in prepay situations, the amount of gas purchase doesn't always fill the tank and cover the shutoff port. So the customer could return the nozzle to the pump stand with the latch still holding the lever in the open position. How does Husky Protector 10S prevent a spill? Husky's new design incorporates a double shutoff in the body of the nozzle. Like the ordinary nozzle, it shuts off when the tank is filled. But it also shuts off when pump pressure drops, thanks to a second spring-loaded rolling diaphragm. That's a key difference. When the customer turns on the pump, gas, usually 20 pounds of pressure, forces the rolling diaphragm into the open position. Fuel flows as long as pressure is maintained. But when the pup shuts off the pressure, the second diaphragm closes and forces up the regular diaphragm. That shuts the poppet valve and stops the flow. Simple and effective. Now, let's see the Husky Protector 10S on the job. In our prepay scenario with the lady customer, you recall the nozzle was in the on position when she removed it from the boot and turned on the pump. The Husky Protector 10S would have turned off automatically when the pre-sale amount was reached by the previous customer, even if the latch still held the member open. That's because the Husky's rolling diaphragm closes when the fuel pressure drops and the nozzle won't dispense fuel again until pump pressure is reapplied and the handle is released. In our situation with the truck driver and the nozzle without the hold open latch, the handle was jammed open with a cigarette lighter. The Husky Protector 10S avoids this possibility because it's equipped with a zip clip hold open latch. So, there's no need to jam the handle. The normal function of the airport shuts the nozzle off when the tank is full and the possibility of tragedy is averted. 
The Husky zip clip latch, by the way, operates with a single finger for easy one-handed operation, something busy customers appreciate. The Husky Protector 10S is the new standard of safety, but there's also another advantage to consider. Let's watch it perform in the five gallon test draw. The pump has been preset to sell five gallons. When the pump stops pumping, the nozzle shuts off immediately. And once the flow has been stopped, the nozzle will not restart until the pump is turned back on and the nozzle lever reset. The Husky Protector 10S. It's the new standard of safety for the fuel dispensing industry. If you were responsible for these pumps, wouldn't you rest easier if it were on the job for you? It's what you'd expect from Husky, the safety first company. Have a safe day.